So here is the yacht house. It's the Netherlands yacht which was built in 2017 and it's the largest yacht which was ever built in Netherlands. Uh, the shipyard name is Akianko. Uh, the length of it is 110 meters. So for more information go to description of the video. So today is 25th of August and uh, this yacht just came to Barcelona today. As you can see there are four decks. The color of the yacht is uh, white with the purple marine, I would say. It's the very first time I see it uh, in Barcelona. Normally at this Panton only Dilbar is staying. So I will have a walk around and uh, you can see everything by yourself without my comments. By the way, the price of this yacht is around 300 million euro. Speaking about owner, I really don't remember, but I'll write down everything in comments. But it's really huge. It's not about the owner, it's about the yacht. <laughs> I think the wallet, the wallet of the owner is huge, seems like. At the top deck you can see the shower and the sun protection tent. These uh, four black tubes seems like it's exhaust pipes. There are a lot of radars at this small white mast with the stairs. Here is the name of the yacht, Chaos. If you know the meaning of this word in English, or I don't know, maybe it's... If it's not English word, please write down in comments what do you think. Don't forget to press like and subscribe. I'll really appreciate it. Compared to the yacht Viva, it's really looking way bigger. But maybe it's the question, maybe it's the matter of a, of a distance from where I'm filming.
<laughs> By the way, if you know, uh, what's the flag of the registration because I can't identify it without Google, feel free to write in comments. At the very same time, you can see the yacht Ace. It's staying just behind at the other side of uh, Port Way. Sorry for video shaking because I'm, I'm making video from my hands. There is a Spanish guest flag. It's the law when you are entering country different from the country of your registration you should put uh, the country of um, of your entrance of, uh, of the place where are you now of the uh, so you understand I like this uh, tender supports for not to scratch to scratch the uh, body of the of the yacht seems like they are made of leather with a fur not so ecologically friendly but still So you can see that it uh, seems like there is a table with some, I don't know, maybe lamps, which is now covered with uh, sun and dust protectors. It's looking like a kind of lounge zone. That wind, you know, I think maximum five knots. That's why it's difficult to rise the flag complete, completely for the wind. So here is the yacht Viva, which I was. Uh, recording yesterday if uh, some sailors are watching my videos you can also see Imoka Imoka 60 seems like with the name Amber Sail already staying in Barcelona for some months but the flag is from Mexico maybe I don't know this, this flag so feel free to write down in comments uh, of which country is this flag I don't know if you'll see but a lamp at the ceiling of the uh, first deck lounge zone is looking quite unusual. So here is 110 meters long yacht house with, with the value of around 300 million euro i'll repeat that it's the biggest yacht ever built by uh, netherland shipyards and uh, this exact uh, yacht was built by the shipyard oceanica you can see how huge are the fenders <laughs> compared to this electricity station which is really not that small trust me if 
you want more information in my videos, uh, please write down uh, which information you'll prefer to hear from me. Uh, for sure, I will uh, write some descriptions during uploading of the video to YouTube. But I'll really appreciate your help if you will uh, if you'll write down in comments how I can improve quality of my videos. I know that uh, the, for the very first time I need to use kind of stabilizers or uh, another camera, but I understand it's another step. Now I'm making videos, I'm recording them with my phone. So quality of iPhone X. It's not advertisement. And here is Viva again. That ship shipyard made in 2021 by uh, Netherlands as well. At the very back, you can see uh, the yacht Samar is staying. I haven't made review of it yet, and if you want to, if you want me to record the review about the yacht Samar, let me know. So I'll pass around one more time for you to enjoy the beauty of the Yacht Chaos under the sun of Barcelona. If any chance uh, you know where I can uh, find the plan of this yacht, it would be super interesting to, to look at it. It's already evening, that's why sun is not that aggressive. I hope camera of iPhone can deliver all the all the beauty of this super yacht. The anchor mechanism is really huge. There are already some stretches, seems like they're using it sometimes. For sure, yes. <laughs> I have no doubts about that. So please like and subscribe and uh, write down in comments what do you think about this yacht. See you soon, bye.